Good evening Check this and out, welcome folks. to the BBC News a great bit of news. It's a drug that's been around for 60 years. It's very cheap and it is widely available. Dexamethasone is a steroid and it's the first drug that has been shown to significantly reduce the risk of death from coronavirus. Incredible. The research has been led by a team at Oxford University who say they were astounded by the results after trials on 2,000 seriously ill patients who were on oxygen or a ventilator. Scientists say that it could have saved thousands of lives in the UK alone if it had been used from the outset of the pandemic. The government's chief scientific advisor called it a groundbreaking development. Here's our medical correspondent, Fergus Bosch. For those laid low by COVID-19, for the very sickest hospital patients, at last, a this drug that can tip the odds in their favour. 6,000 NHS COVID patients were part of the trial and the results were so overwhelmingly positive they were rushed out days after it was completed. It found that dexamethasone saves one life for every eight patients on a ventilator and one life saved for every 25 patients on oxygen. If it had been used from the outset of the pandemic, it's thought it could have saved four to 5,000 lives in the UK. Wow. Catherine Milbank from Buckinghamshire spent 12 days on a ventilator with COVID-19. She received dexamethasone after her husband Paul gave consent over the phone for her to take part in the trial. When someone tells you that your wife's right hanging on the edge um, of something that could go either way and you know that there's current proven drugs that are already in the you know in the medical industry already that are, are prescribed to people when you know that they are around and there's a chance that might help you you grab it without trying these things we're not the researchers us no one's going to get anywhere in finding out the, the right drugs to well, help she was lucky to get through it wasn't she happening and still going on as we're coming through it but i'm just so. eternally grateful and will be for the rest of my life Dexamethasone has been around for decades. A steroid, it's widely used for arthritis, asthma wow. and other conditions. This is a genuine breakthrough in the treatment of COVID-19. Dexamethasone, either in tablet or injectable form, is available in every hospital pharmacy. Oh, the hell? treatment costs around £5 on the NHS wow. and will be even cheaper in developing countries. So this drug has the potential to save lives across the world. Oh man, that's brilliant. We've been on a huge search for treatments that actually will improve survival for patients with COVID. This is the first drug. Crikey. Not only is this the first drug that is survival, but it's available worldwide immediately wow. and is affordable. Praise the Lord. That's fantastic news for patients. The drug helps stop the immune system from overreacting to COVID. It's not a cure, but it will help more yeah. of the sickest patients to overcome this disease. The latest figures from the Department of Health show that in the last 24-hour period, 233 more deaths linked to coronavirus were recorded after testing positive. That right. brings the total to just under 42,000 across the UK, which includes hospitals, care homes and the wider community. If we look at the graph of COVID-19 deaths since the middle of March, the trend now very much continues down with the current seven-day rolling average at 155. Our medical correspondent, Fergus Walsh, is with me now. Tell us more about this drug, which has been around for a very long time. And crucially, the Prime Minister says, if there is another wave, second peak, we have enough of it. I think this is a huge moment and a really positive one for patients, Sophie. There's been this long, long search now over six months for a treatment. And a word of caution, it doesn't stop people from catching coronavirus. It doesn't help those with mild infection. Mm. But for the sickest patients, it brings huge potential wow, benefits. It's really and it's heartening that the first yeah. treatment proven to save lives is not some expensive new drug which will only be available in yeah. rich countries, millions, but a, a cheap as chip steroid that's been around since America, the 60s. Right? So now at last, doctors have a proven tool which can help save lives in intensive care. Well, that is Walsh, thank you. Absolutely amazing. The Manchester United footballer Marcus Rashford has thanked MPs for giving families one less thing to worry about Another after a major government U-turn on free school meals this summer. More than a million vulnerable children in England will benefit from the decision to run the voucher scheme through the okay, holidays. Then. Our chief political correspondent Vicky Young reports. It's Rashford, his latest opportunity. 
Yay. He's used to taking on opponents and winning. But this campaign has been unlike any other for Marcus Rashford. Rashford has had to work for that. He's spoken about his own experience, relying on preschool meals, and he's raised millions of pounds to provide food for right. families anyway, in need. I'm going to say, um, oh, that was a bit of luck, wasn't it? Now we've got more or less a cure. That's incredible. Oh, thank God for that. We're going in the right direction. It's like a load lifted off people's minds, that will be. It's just brilliant. Anyway, thanks for watching. Um, Please um, click on the little um, dog icon or um, on the gladiator when it comes up and subscribe. Thanks for watching. I hope that's been helpful and taking some worries off your mind. All the best. Signing off, Matt. London calling.